Collocation three, my pet rat. Learning goal: Students can recognize English collocation by reading some examples. A collocation is a series of words or terms that co-occur more often than would be expected by chance. Collocations are a great way to make your language sound more natural and fluent. Native speakers use them to add variety in their speech and to enrich in their expressions. We should read as much as possible. Reading is an excellent way to learn vocabulary and collocations in context and naturally. When we learn a new word, write down other words that collocate with it. Here are some examples. Remember correctly. Remember vaguely. Remember vividly. I can't believe that my mom finally agreed. She said that I could get a pet rat. I've wanted a pet rat for such a long time. I know that a pet rat is kind of a weird pet to have, but I just think they're so cute. I've been reading a lot of books about rats. They're actually very interesting animals. They are so clever. You can train them to come to you when you call their name, just like a dog. I will call my pet rat Cheese Thief. In the movies, rats always like to eat cheese. Did you know that's not true? I read that rats actually shouldn't eat cheese. It can make them really sick. You should feed a pet rat fresh vegetables and some special rat food that you can buy at the pet store. Instead of buying my new pet rat from the pet store, my mom. Said that we will go to the animal shelter. At the animal shelter, you can adopt pet rats for free. Before I can get my pet rat, I will need to buy a cage and some bedding for it. I want a cage with lots of tunnels and an exercise wheel. Rats are very smart, so they need a lot of toys to play with. It's important that you keep your rat's cage squeaky clean. Some people think rats are dirty, but that's not true at all. They clean themselves all the time by licking their fur. Rather like a cat does. I told my friend Simon that I was going to get a pet rat. He said that he thinks rats are gross. I felt quite sad when he said that. I think he doesn't understand how smart rats are. Simon has a pet bird. 
It's a parrot, and it's really smart, too. He trained his pet bird to talk. It can say, hello, how are you? And Polly want a cracker? I asked him to train it to say my name, but he said it would take too long. Maybe parrots aren't so smart after all. One day, I hope I can have a house packed with pets. I want to get a pet dog, a pet cat, a pet rabbit, and some goldfish. My friend Simon said he only ever wants one pet. He's happy with his parrot. That's lucky because I read that parrots can live to be 50 years old. Rats only live for about two years. You really have to treasure the time you have with them.